Guys, welcome back to part six of my Omega Ruby Pokemon gameplay. I just finished the last video. As you saw, I had to learn to move dive for my new Pokemon and go underwater with them. So now I learned the move dive to Latheos, who is also my fly Pokemon. But I gotta get to Route 128. So far, so good. I discovered this passageway off of 126 right over here. Then I'll get to 128 really easily and I will underwater dive and get going where I need to be going. But so far, you miss. I just deleted the last video because I've been just walking around and going underwater and everything so I just deleted it because that was just me searching for the right place and now that I discover it I can go on with a action-packed video because the last one was so boring I had to flush it so finally route 127 now I just fought one of these guys before and they are tough Now I gotta go underwater and figure out a way to dive to get to Route 128. <laughs> Let's go underwater with Lithios. Whoa, I'm not going to the right place. Need to find this underwater cave. Route 128, how about it? Found it in one shot. What's over here? Nothing. Is this it? Is this the legendary cave? Sea floor cavern, wow. Guess I found it. Let's return to the surface. Hey, the bad guys are here. Let's go kill the bad guys. This is where the story continues. Team Magma is right here. Oh my gosh. Now I switch which Pokemon. I was afraid of fighting a bunch of underwater uh, Pokemons, but... Uh, I think I'll be fine. Use strength to push the boulders and fight those team magma creeps. Which is the right way to go? Which another gold bat? Come on. Do your trick, Pikachu! Fifty-three! Not bad! <gasps> he wants to learn what? Light screen? It's a psychic move? I hate psychic moves. No thank you. Don't waste my time with psychic moves. I hate them. I hate psychic. 
Pokemons, I hate psychic moves, I hate them all. Oh my gosh, there's gonna be a lot of gold bats. Did I choose the right door to go through? Oh no, I hate those type of maps. Caves. You wasted my time. Okay, let's not walk back and just push the boulder in. We should be fine. Iron defense. Let's just check it out. The user. Oh man, another move that I don't like. No. I'm gonna keep my old moves. Yes, thank you so much. Have a good night. Am I going in the right place? Oh, almost made it to the door. Where is Team Magma in all this? This must be the place. No, I can't go there. There's too much current. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's a tricky place. That's what it is. If I go there, this goes there. That goes fine. But th 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 that doesn't help at all. All right. Tricky place. Oh, tricky place. No, no, no! Come on, tricky place. Yes! Team Magma fight! Come on, push the boulder! Blastoise, push it! This must be the right place. Is this the final like stage or something? Send out your goons, buddy. Oh no. Pikachu's not strong enough for this. What will I do? Not strong enough. Oh no. That's evil. What are you doing all these moves for if you're not killing me, buddy? There you go, Spark. Wheezing. I'm a Swiss Pokemon. Yes, I will. Dragon Pulse.
All right, let me pass, buddy. I got the big boss to go kill. This must be the right place. Has to be the right place. Uh... I did wrong on that one. I can't push that one back. No! Let's go back and try to figure out a way to... Uh... I can't go in. Am I supposed to go up there and not push those there? Um... Sure, but I can't push it. Okay, wait, wait. I walk out, walk back in. Everything's gonna be ship shape. Or maybe not. Okay. Let's be smart. And push these guys in the middle. Obviously. Push that guy down. Out of my way. Thank you. But I won't be able to get out. Or will I? Oh, there's lava. Team Magma must be near. Another one? How original. That's all there is down here. Gold Bats. I don't want to capture it. I hate that Pokemon. I had it on my first game back when I was like... 20 years ago. <laughs> I can't recall. 10, 15, 20, yeah, it must be 20 years ago. All right, let's go kick some Team Magma butt. I can feel it, they are Nia. Oh, wow, never saw that one before. Go back. This must be it. Giant hole earthquake. Nice. TM26 earthquake. Now, before I jump into that hole. What am I supposed to do? I'll go. I'll put Charizard in first. Venusaur in second. No, that's second, right? Anywho, I'm good with that. Now, oh yeah, I want to put my PP back up on my uh, on my Pikachu. But I don't have any. Too bad. Go for it. Let's go. Jump in the hole. This is it. Who oh, no. knew? Ha 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 ha. How pathetic you appear now. The fool Archie. Maxi, you. Let 
This is it. <laughs> I like that laugh. <laughs> Just as I predicted. A little scamp. Even I, Great Maxi, have found myself wishing for something I cannot justify. And the illogical desire that a board was to have a present here at this moment. And now that fool wish to come is true. Fantastic. Nothing could please me more. Suppose I could make introductions. I present to you my incomparable partner who will assist the magma in driving humanity forwards to its next level. The supreme ancient Pokemon Galdron? Behold, this great form slumbering in defiance of even the boiling lava surrounding it. So long I have waited for this day. Immeasurably long, the foolish world has held back humanity progress out of misguided idealism regarding the coexistence of human and Pokemon. But this ancient creature can bring that to a rightful end, creating a new land upon which humanity may stride freely forward. Now that I have the last obtained the power of Primal Guldron, and now you are the final obstacle remaining between me and my goals. Behoves we to use every tool at my disposal to eliminate you indeed, even magma evolution. Do not delude yourself that you and your Pokemons are the only ones capable of it. I must apologize for making you way through our encounters at Mon Chimney and Mon Pyre without treating you to this sight. Brace yourself for ultimate attack. This is the final battle? I'm scared. This is the final battle. And he's sending out the dog? I thought he could send out something a little bit stronger, man. Dragon Paws, goodbye. So long, so sad. Good night. Now seriously, is this the final battle? I like the ending song though. Super heavy metal Pokemon wheezing, come on. Can't be the final battle. How come every time I hit them, they always stay a little bit alive? Finish them with Flame Burst. What else you got in your bag, buddy? Poison Fang? Now he's gonna poison me? Of course I got poisoned. So cool. Thank you so much. One attack from that piece of crap. Pokemon. Dragon Pulse again. That's all I care about. Send out your last Pokemon, buddy. Man, that poison is really killing me. Camera up. He's going for camera up. Camera up. Switch Pokemons. I'm going to use Surf with my Blastoise. And that will be the end of it.
Yo. I wasn't expecting that mega evolution. So scared. He almost lost his glasses, Maxi. Maxi pads he can go sleep. Come on. Ha 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 Splendid, just splendid. My young trainer. No one. It is more than that. I should be calling you my young hero. Believe until the very end that the world where humanity and Pokemons coexist must be the best. Rejecting my ideas without a second thought. Yes, watching you struggle desperately to halt the beginning of the world's end. You are undoubtedly a hero. So noble, and yet, I will not yield, I will not blend, my ideals will not be shaken. My dreams for the world's next step forward will never change. I will use Red Orb to awaken Goldron, revert it to its primal form, and put an end to all else. Wait, Maxi. Who's that? Tabita, don't stop that now, please, Maxi. Don't do do stop. Do stop. You just don't understand what Goldron will bring upon awakening is the end of the world. Did you think I not noticed that I had somehow failed to realize you were after my spot such a sad development indeed to be betrayed by my number two in the end there is only one upon which i can depend now gudron absorb all the power resting in this red orb and reclaim yourself revert to your primal form this is the time to make back the great evolution you lost in the ancient past. Reclaim the possibility you once held. Oh no. Did I get to fight him? Nice! Epic cutscene, I love it. How come you didn't get burned from that, man? Where's he going? He's going for that town. At last, I finally done it. A new world for human evolution will be born. We shall stride forward. Oh, what have you done, boss? What? Message for our members outside. What is it? So the sun is stern mercilessly fierce in its heat and should expect so that is what i have long know what we have long wished for i don't get it what's the heat is greater than simulation than simulations predicted it will be at risk to our own safety if it continues that cannot be it has only just awoken where is the getting so much power from? And how much more will it gain when it does undergo primal reversion? 
Continue your readings, then report back. Boss Maxi, just what's happening on the surface? The world is burning, man. All that matters is that I have used the Red Orb to awaken Gul'dran. And now, I will transform this planet to a land ideal for humanity. Hey, Maxi, looks like they underestimate the power of the super ancient Pokemons. Power of the Primal Reversion. What did you say? Primal Gudron brings about an end all light, but you don't get to choose what end. Oh, it's gonna dive. It's gonna drive every living thing on this planet to its death. The only thing waiting for us is despair. A despair we can't even run from. A despair that's gonna crush humanity. You blasted fool. Oh my gosh. He burnt everything. This is not what I wanted to make. I was supposed to be a world where a human race would attain new heights. The next stage of our developments. It was all for humanity's future. I thought the guy wanted to destroy the place. Boss Maxi. So this is the power of the super ancient Pokemon. This is how Gul'dran brings everything to an end. All of us people and Pokemons, everything living this planet on this planet. Everything is going to die. Okay, little scamp. We're setting sail for Sutopolis. I know where to go. The blasted good ground is no doubt going to let there ahead of us. I'll be waiting for us deep in the cave origin there in Sutopolis. There is a pool energy there that folks say it's needful of primal reversion. There is no doubt in my mind that Guldron will be racing to that cave, thirsting for that power. We got no choice but to go ourselves. We gotta do whatever we can. Fight back. Alright, Maxi. You team Magma Blighters better comes with us. We're responsible for this mess, this ridiculous, impossible mess. It only makes sense for all of us to step up and clean up after ourselves. Agreed. Oh man, enough with the talking, I'm bored. Let's go, boss Maxi. Yay! No, no, don't talk. Don't talk. Don't, don't. Hey, little scamp. Look, I'm supposed to be grow up, right? So let me say sorry for the way this has gone down. I'm sorry because I've got to ask you to pitch in new with the cleanup. We need every hand on deck if we're going to do something about this mess. Come on, could you stop talking? So I'll be waiting for you at Sutopolis. More talking! I'm sorry I couldn't be here sooner. Terrible. So what was being depicted in that painting in Granite Cave? If it doesn't top, all stop. All Owens know the entire world will burn up. Nothing can live in such a land of debt. Neither Pokemon nor humans. This dreadful blaze, it must be caused by this sweltering heat wave forming above Sutopolis. Come on, Steven, think what do you think? What are you going to do? There's no point of no point in agonizing over the situation from here. I have to go to Sutopolis. There must be an answer here. Malus doll, I will count on your help with this crisis, but please promise you won't do anything reckless. 
Well then, I'll go ahead and shoot Topolis. Good luck to you. All right. Oh my gosh. Next time, Pokemon games on the new 3DS, have your own guys talk. So guys, stay tuned for part seven. I'm done with this talking and reading. Can't wait for part seven to see what, I'm pretty sure I'm close to the ending. So stay tuned and stay put. It's gonna be good.